Hi, I'm Elliot from Show and Joe, and today I'd like to give you an overview of the Nebo app. Nebo is a free app available on both the iOS and Android app stores, so make sure you download it first there. If you haven't heard about Nebo before, Nebo is the app to automate your captain's logs as well as connect with other boaters. Let's start with creating an account. Either create an account through Apple, Google, Facebook, or use your email and password and begin entering information about your boat. Note, if you don't have a boat, you can skip this step. Finally, just keep in mind that while Nebo has an amazing map, it is not meant to be used for navigation. The Nebo team is consistently updating their user experience, so while certain details may change, we're going to be covering the main features that make Nebo one of our widely used boating apps. Beginning with the home screen and map, this is what makes Nebo social. By zooming out very quickly, you can begin to see all boats in your area. You can press on their name and icon to learn about their boat and even message them. From here, you can also add other boaters to your friends list. If you have a specific boat that you're looking for, you can use the search feature to find them. It's important to mention that if you do want to keep your privacy, you are able to mark your profile as private, which will hide your information to all of your non-friends. Another amazing feature on Nebo's homepage are the community markers. Community markers give you the capability to view and create different points of interest for your fellow boaters. Whether it's something you need to be careful about, like a hazard or something you shouldn't miss, like a beautiful landmark, you can find them here. An interesting section which I think could change the game for safe cruising, which we care a lot about on board Pivot, is real-time reported weather conditions. These are specific community markers that are only active for two hours. As far as recording voyages, the home screen will look a little bit differently if you are using the Nebo link. Now if you hadn't heard about the Nebo link, that is Nebo's hardware device that you physically connect into your boat's systems that will record your voyages for you. The Nebo link automatically detects when your boat is moving so you don't have to manually start and stop your voyages. Now, if you're not using the Nebo link, you will have to manually start and stop your voyage. While you're underway, Nebo shows your current GPS location, your current speed, as well as different other metrics for your current voyage. Now let's move on to the other screen, starting with your feed. On your feed, you can keep track of and share your voyages with your friends. It's a great way to stay connected in the community and you can like and comment and have a discussion there. On the flip side of the feed, you'll have your friends list, which will have all of your friends as well as any pending requests that you've sent or that are awaiting you to click accept or deny. Next up is one of our favorite features on Nebo, which is their chat feature. You can send a chat to one or a group message to many boaters at once. We're frequently using this feature to ask about conditions, ask about an anchorage, if there's enough room for another boat, or just simply to coordinate docktails. Now let's go into our locker where we can manage our boat, configure our Nebo link, and set up our startup checklist. The logs tab is where you'll go to review your past voyages. One thing to keep in mind is if you are using Nebo Link, it's going to be tracking your individual boat movements. We have hours wired into our ignition system, meaning that every time we turn off our boat pivot, it's the end of a boat movement. So on days where we have, let's say, five locks in the Erie Canal, we're going to have multiple logs. If you're only using the app, it's up to you when you start and stop the voyage. All this being said, all of your movements for the day are compiled into your daily report, so you'll be able to see it in one place there. Nebo includes all of the pertinent information automating your captain's logs. We have an interactive map showing the start and end location. What's especially cool is that Nebo geofences a lot of the relevant lo locations that you're traveling through, so it will know where you are outside of just a GPS point. In this case, it knows we weighed anchor outside of Ancloak Key and ended our cruise at Dunedin Marina. Along the cruise, Nebo will also record the current weather conditions and when you cross into specific bodies of water. On this day, St. Joseph Sound. Nebo also includes relevant information like your distance, your average speed, as well as the total duration of your cruise. These features have saved us a lot of time, so instead of manually kind of keep trying to keep track of them and putting them into our captain's log, Nebo just records them all for us. The boats tab is where you can configure each boat you own into individual profiles. If you have Nebo link, this is where you would set it up, and you can see the status of your Nebo link by the icon near your boat name. Since Pivot is an older boat, we don't have a lot of technology showing our boat's status if we are off our boat, but we use this icon and the Nebo link voltage, which refers to the voltage of our internal battery bank, as an easy way to check into our boat to see how it is if we're off of it for a while. Nebo can also simply alert you if your batteries go below a predefined voltage. 
Here you can also set up the startup checklist in which Neva will prompt you to fill out before you start cruising. For example, you can create your own checklist with sunscreen, drinks, hats, engine checks, and anything else you want to include. You can also add this boat to more than one skipper. This way if you have multiple skippers, they can all use Nevo to keep track of the boat. Now the last tab on the Nevo app is the profile tab. Here is where you can update your email, name, and put your profile in private, which means you only show to the map and feed to your friends. And you can also get your Track Me link. The Track Me link can be used to share your location to non-Nevo users. It is a link to a website showing where your boat is for any friends or family that want to keep track of you. Finally, there's a settings icon in the top right corner that you can use to update your metrics. Going back and forth between a imperial and metric, nautical miles to kilometers or miles, as well as contact Nebo if you have any questions. On top of the app as a whole, Nebo gives you a really nice monthly summary that we love to see. It's cool to see exactly where your boat has been and your average speeds displayed in a really nice format. We've even used this to determine our fuel burn per hour and determine our optimal cruising speed for fuel efficiency. All in all, we hope you download Nebo to check out these amazing features. It really is the best companion app to boating. Thanks for watching.